This is Hawkeye and I am back with Anna Melica. and the last time I was playing this I was on the island that I had uh, I think it was called Autumn Leaves or something like that. Well I had filled up with all kinds of loot and gear and I had to go back because I couldn't carry anymore and I don't know if you remember but I had also died so there was a lot more still to do there but I thought I better come back here drop off my stuff and while I was here, I decided that maybe I need to start finding the stuff to get together some tranquilizer darts. I did a lot of off-screen stuff, guys, but when I was doing that, I happened to find a really cool item, guys. Check this out. This is a crossbow. <laughs> yes, the hawk has his crossbow. And you can, it's got a scope on it and everything, guys. Now, is that awesome or what? <laughs> yep, we are ready to rock and roll with this crossbow. And I also have this awesome sword, as you saw before. This is an amazing close-up melee weapon. So, I am ready to rock and roll. I've got a fire axe. I've got some good weapons here and good tools here, guys. But basically what I've been doing over the past couple of, of days, I've been trying to collect resources. I've been exploring this entire island where my main base is and just getting it freed up of all those damn monsters. Because you can destroy the monster spawners. And once you do that, then the monster spawners, when they're, they're gone, the monsters don't just keep coming back. But I think that I have cleared all of them out except for maybe one or two. I do know that there was one over this direction somewhere. I'll go ahead and grab a little bit of stone there. But these are some weird looking mutant creatures. I mean, I mean really weird looking. They kind of look like birds, sort of. Maybe raptor, sort of. I don't know. <laughs> they're, they're weird. Let's just put it that way. But I think they're over on this side. Now, we're on the opposite side of the island right now. But it is an island. There is... You can walk all the way around it. It does take a little bit of time, but you can do so. And I've explored just about every enclosure, nook, and cranny... Yep, there they are. Alright, what we're going to do is we're going to get this crossbow ready and we're going to take these guys out. That's what we're going to do. Okay, there's one right there. It looks a lot like a raptor, doesn't it? Uh-oh, now we got to fight it. They're not too tough. That's a good thing. Right, let's see if we can't loot it. We've got hard skin, some feathers. That's what's nice about getting these guys. You can get feathers for your arrows. But I think that weird looking thing over there is the spawner. I thought I saw another one over there. Let me look through here. Yeah, I think that's the spawner there.
Yeah, we're gonna need to eat something, guys. Let's see, what have I got in here to eat? Because my health is down just a touch. He did, he did hit me good one time. Also, I found another dog, and I was just able to pick him up. I didn't have to even tranquilize him. I think it's because he's so far gone with the infection that you, in some cases, you can just pick them up. Uh. Oh, I see raw meat. That's not good. Uh-oh! Whoa! I guess he saw me. Ow. I need to run. I need to run. Very fast run. Because I do not have... any health left. Oh boy, he's keeping up with me too. Better get my sword going. Yeah, I don't like these things. They're mean. Okay, I'm gonna try to get back in this corner. Wow. Wow, like wow. That was like so close. If he'd have hit me one more time, that'd have been it. I can't believe I didn't bring any food. Let me see if I... Let me take a drink and see if that helps. Nope. <laughs> it's not going to help. I'm going to have to eat something, guys. Yeah, that's, those are mushrooms. I've got... I've got no food. Restore stamina, quenches thirst. Got cans, I got rose hips for potions. I do not have any food. That was, uh, that's stupid. <laughs> Go ahead and grab some of these things that are lying around. But I need to get as much of that stuff together as I can because I gotta be able to make some tranquilizers and some cure potions and some tame potions anyway guys I'll be right back I'm gonna head back to the main base back in the main part of the island kinda went in a roundabout way but we're here did find out that I thought if I left all the enclosures gates open that I could easily tell which ones I've been to and it worked but when I came back they were all closed again, so I think after so long they close on their own. Anyway, let's grab us some food because our health is so poor right now. I'm sh I mean, if somebody sneezes on me, I'm going to die. Alright, let's put some ham in here. And I think I'm going to go ahead and cook some meat here. I've got like 30 raw meat here. Whoop. Let's get our health up. There we are. We're 100%. I don't know why in the world I didn't carry food with me. That was just really, really stupid. <laughs> But yeah, I've got a lot of loot. I need to unload some stuff anyway because it's about the time to do that. But yeah, I've got things separated out and organized a little bit better. So we can now put stuff away in their proper locations. I was trying to find certain things because I really need the tranquilizer stuff more than anything else at this point. All right, guys, we are rested and got a lot of our stuff put away. I don't know where it's Poppy is. I can hear her crying over here somewhere. I think she got herself stuck behind the stuff. I don't know. I heard her crying. She might be outside, actually. Let's see. What's the matter, girl? Where are you?
Didn't realize I could pick that up. There she is. Hi, sweetie. What's the matter? Why are you all by yourself? Huh? Poor little girl. Yeah, there is another dachshund somewhere on this island. It's over there by that garage that I found earlier on, and I want to go... That's one of the reasons I want to get a tranquilizer thing. I want to go get that, but I'll tell you, one thing I need to do before I do anything else, guys, now that I think about it. I was told... I was about to get myself squished. I was told that you can go to a certain island or area and purchase an item from a vendor that will allow you to know where your body is if you die. And you have no idea how useful that will be after that last... But they said it was at Corpse Harbor right here. The Amber Hills where we were. So I think we're going to be going to visit Corpse Harbor. The sun's coming up. And we're going to go to Corpse Harbor and see if we can't make some purchases. Looks like... It doesn't look all that inviting, does it? <laughs> Alright, I guess I'm here. This is... Uh, Interesting looking place. <laughs> okay, they... That can't be good. Alright guys, how's it going? How you doing? Um, hello? Can I talk to you? I guess not. Alright, well, I guess this must be it. This must be the place. Materials Trader. E to trade. Alright. Alright, let's see. What has he got? Shoot. Well, maybe this is... Maybe I need to go somewhere else. Oh, Materials Trader. I bet I need to go somewhere else. Probably don't want to collect anything. What is this? Yeah, it might tick somebody off if you pick something up that you're not roof tiles. Yeah, just better be careful because, I mean, there's like corpus delecti everywhere and I don't want to be one. Let's see here, guys. Uh, oh, doggy. You okay? Uh, I don't have anything to knock him out with. Well, we'll do a little bit of exploring. Maybe we'll find some place. Yeah, see how they're red? Usually they're not red. That probably means you don't want to take it. There's a chicken. Hi, chicken. I want a chicken. Okay, so far so good. If they're yellow, maybe I saw maybe it's all right. Get some scrap metal there. Ooh, can we break this? We might be able to break this down, guys. Yep.
Alright. See how they're different colors though? So I don't know. Let's see what this is. Coin press. Used to press metal coins. Nice. More plastic. Tools. Stove. Deco plant. Pick a couple of stools. I can always use stuff to decorate with. Ooh, there's a horse. There's a horse, of course, of course. Ooh, look at all the horses. Jeez. Looks like they've got a collection of some animals here already. That one. Are they just dogs? Yeah. That's one of those monsters. Is he tame or something? Look at a couple of Bengal tigers, white ones. Oh, the smile guys. Hi, guys. Yeah, these guys are kind of... They don't talk much. Well, I don't know what to do about getting that item. I really, really, really need it. <laughs> oh, there's yeah. something over here. What is this? Shotgun shells. Of course I need a shotgun. More tools. Well, they haven't come to attack me, so I guess picking it up isn't going to hurt anything. They're just standing there at attention. If that's the case, I'm just going to loot the shit out of them. Because <laughs> I can use all of this stuff. Roof tiles, I mean... Yeah. Hell yeah! yeah. Alright. Eh, I can't take any of the plants. I'll be taking this. I'll be taking this. I'll be taking this. I'll be taking this. Can't take that. Apples. Yeah. Okay, I can't do anything with those, or those, or those. Let's see, anything up here yeah. I can do, use? Let's see. The landscapers need a trade. Okay, cool. Let's see. So this is where you can get stuff to put all around. Oh, this is cool. Bamboo and juniper and stumps and logs and... So since this is another guy to trade with, that definitely means that we've got more to explore here, guys. And, you know, honestly, this may be not the only place to trade. There may be other locations, too. Wait a minute, here's another guy. Ooh, an animal trader. Nice! So you can trade all kinds of animals with him, hmm? 
We want to keep something in there, that's for sure. Yeah, they don't look like those, those dogs don't look too happy. There's another guy over here. Let's see what he's got. General Goods. Military boots. I wonder how much that's... Ooh, 100 gold coins. Shotgun. How much is it? Ooh, it's pricey. The art book, Asian crafts, portable stove, water filter. He'll give me a hundred for that. Guys, I'm gonna. Here it is. Death beacon, gold coin. Perfect. I am buying that sucker. It will drop upon death showing your death location on the radar. Shift click to equip it. And it is equipped. Nice. But I have a feeling it's only a one time use. <laughs> But I did find it, and that is a good thing. So let's see if there's anybody else we can trade here with. I am going to grab the beer, though. What's in here? Taters? Tomatoes? I wonder if I could break that in. Yep. Ouch. Let's see if the axe does better. How about the... Eh, about the same either way. Upgrading kit, bagels, potatoes, ah shoot, these are health kits but I can't pick them up. Stick up on your room, apples, apples, apples. Got plenty of goodies here. More shotgun shells. I'm definitely going to have to get some shotgun. A shotgun. Almost every game I've either had a crossbow or a shotgun or both. Getting all kinds of food here, guys. This is this was definitely worth the trip. Dog food. I guess if we get a dog. And we do have a dog. We have a Poppy. Poppy the puppy. Well, we have thoroughly looted them of their stuff. Yeah. Just can't get those health kits. Damn it. Yeah, some of this stuff is just for looks. Grab the vice. And it seems strange. It seems like it, if we're doing that, they would be pretty ticked off that we're taking their stuff, but they don't seem to be all bothered by it. Let's see, purified water, canned fish, leather, matches, alcohol, salami. Don't have enough room. Damn. Well, I am going to have to go back, I guess. I just have too much stuff. 
There's a workshop over here. There's another dead body. Hmm. <laughs> Lots of dead bodies. That's a little worrisome. That's why I'm like, I hope I'm not ticking these people off by taking their stuff, but they don't seem to be bothered by it. And as long as they're not bothered by it, I'm taking it, damn it. <laughs> Heck with it. Well, I think my inventory is completely full, guys. So, we're going to have to head on out of here. What is this thing over here? That's kind of weird. Okay. <laughs> we are going to head on out of here, and we're going to travel back. To our land base and drop this stuff off and so I'll say sayonara to Corpse Harbor all right we are back home and we are going to head back down here but guys I tell you we're gonna be going back to Corpse Harbor again after I drop off most of this stuff we're going to try to take some stuff over there, like those corrupted hearts and stuff like that. And we might be able to get those sold to these guys and get some coins. Because I really, seriously want to get a shotgun. I mean, without a doubt. And I've got a lot of stuff here. I don't know what... See, we've got upgrades. We've got for shotguns. And we've got roof tiles. We've got all kinds of good stuff here. This is an upgrading kit for a sniper. We got toolboxes and vices. I mean, we did major haul there, guys. But I tell you what, this is probably about about 20 minutes, if not longer. But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe. And I will be back with another episode of Animalica. Not sure what we're going to be doing this next time, but I would imagine it's going to be doing some exploring. So until then, guys, always remember, aim straight, cast far, and have fun, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.